thing with confidence. And this is a great opportunity for guys that don't play that much to gain that confidence. Yeah, they stepped up the other night. They did. I they really did. When Luca had... Playing with so much confidence. Yeah. Whether he's starting, coming off the bench, it doesn't yeah. matter. He's yeah, he's letting it fly. He's a baller. He's shooting 38% on... Though, is that you do get on-floor experience from being out there. I don't think there's any substitute for that. Nice attack. That hot. John Starks got him hot. And uh, I, I took the rest of that. That was Dinwiddie who was fouled in the act of shooting. It was Dinwiddie. And he lobbed it right where Dwight Powell could finish on the inside. His growth presence is so important for the yeah. offense. Brunson with it against Kevin Porter Jr. Late shot clock situation to the cup. He scores. One point game. With the pull up, no good. 12 games with the Rockets. He's averaging about 11 points and six assists. Oh my God. Yeah, man, that's a blow by, right? Okay. I'll bring him. Next time I know he's going to be up. <laughs> I want the number for Dinwiddie, oh, that's nice. The player, outstanding, shooting the ball from the three-point line. He's lit up Houston for 11 points in the first quarter as Shindun scores to beat the week before. Yeah. He's been averaging 38. Yep. You know, doing an incredible hey, job, oh not only defensively, but then making Cat play defense. Cross-court Dinwiddie. Yes. Hey. Brown. Man, you can write him down. 18-point game so far not even to the midpoint of the second quarter and this kj martin level and a strong point for the maps tonight that is a fancy pass by schroeder fancy pass by schroeder to shin goon and with that the right to the two, but they get a perimeter shots until everybody is kind of stuck on their guy I think he victory. Green will get it. He'll get better. Okay. On the trade ball. Getting deeper position. Green. And trying to go back to Green. Porter on the fast break. And they do. Delivering a 1 8 punch tonight. Yeah. Be one, two, and three scores when you talk about those. Jalen still working off the dribble against Tate. Kleba has it inside and scores. But you got to establish up on the defensive end of the floor. You know, wow. you know like it's a team like this, you're going to score. As you can see, wow. you're going to give up a ton of points. More paint points. That's how we played this team. You saw that particular play ran yep. over and over and over again. Crunch an easy basket to the rim that time. No. Not at all. And Houston will shoot another three. This one is good, though. Played there for a year. Dinwiddie to Brunson. Brunson got pointed on the seat. And the giant killer for the foul. It's December the 27th, but a miss on that opportunity for three to Hardway. Climbed the ladder as far as percentage. To Dodo, very into the shot clock, and a contested jumper is off the back iron, and he put it up on the rim. Powell, Smith, bam! And Golden State, the last I looked, was leading Miami by 13 points in the last minute of the game, and the final was one for Golden State over Miami. Three, Minnesota leads that one by a point early in the fourth quarter. Huh. No! Try score, yeah. Jalen Brunson. To go along with six points after he just made a couple of free throws. Kenny Smith on the money. 5-13, gentlemen, is the advantage for the Mavs here in the third quarter of the game. It's a great cut. Oh, it's a great cut. Jalen's 8 for 9 tonight, and this is the seventh time this year that Brunson has scored 25-plus in a game. He's at 26. The handle on it. K.J. Martin inside. Schroeder, quick pass. Green after the fly-by closeout. will shoot a three. It's no good. Garrison Matthews flying in to score. Energy. Effort. Those kind of plays. Valuable plays. Brunson on attack again. And scoring again. The two. A one, a one of the three. Yeah. And the other two can beat you just as easily. You're poison, you're in trouble. And that ball falls for Powell. Right place, right time. Nilokina, catch and shoot three from the corner. He didn't get him one. Maybe not right off the steal against Schroeder, but he knocks it. 
That Nilantina shot is confirmed as a two as Martin misses a chippy and Dinwiddie nice inside to score. Well, it's 20-20 vision in the backcourt for the Mavericks tonight. Jalen Brunson, 28. Spencer Dinwiddie now over the 20-point plateau with 21 with that Ooh. score right before the timeout. And there's Shingoon muscling up inside. 9.22 left in tonight's game. You're seeing some scores flash by on the screen right now, including Boston with a 28-point win tonight over Utah and Golden State with a 14-point win over Miami. Doesn't get the bounce. Oh. Offensive rebound. There is Shingoon as a presence again, but unable to finish after the board. And Nilapina walks past Josh Christopher and puts it on a ladder for Finney Smith to climb the ladder. Martin is to three and attacking the defensive glass. Maxi Kleba, team high, eighth rebound in tonight's game. And Nilapina feeling it right now. Yes, sir. Yeah. Chase Sean Tate trying to draw a foul on the offensive rebound. No dice. Finney Smith at open three. Oh, Line and on the money. The Mavs activated Moses Wright, who they signed to a two way contract coming up with an all star break. So he's active tonight. We'll see if he can talk to him here late in the game as Nilakina is taking advantage of his run. And look, two. <laughs> this seventh grade C team numbers not on basketball reference for follow. So, I mean, when you're a chump and you have to have tape over one of the numbers in your jersey because. There's two number 12s, and so follow, you're going to be number two. You need that kind of leadership, though, especially now. I mean, you just talked about 10 games being left, right? I always say the teams that play the best and have the most success. Hey, welcome to Dallas Moses right with that basket, by the like way. that finish on yep. the inside of the open time. And it was a three the old-fashioned way for 23-year-old Moses Wright from Raleigh, North Carolina. There's Nilakina. He's in two double figures. Already was, as a matter of fact. Now that's three 20-plus point scoring seasons there. Bruno Fernando, who had a heck of a game against the Mavericks earlier this month. He went eight for eight for the floor of that game, scoring 16 yeah. points. A 110-91 to 91 victory. That is a nice birthday present for Jason Kidd. The Mavericks outscore the Rockets 58-38 in the second half after the Rockets led this game by a point at halftime.